Hi everybody, welcome back to Bubble Pop Kids. We're doing it again, another candy bonanza. I always get so, so many requests to do these and I love it because I get to show you the coolest candy and test it out. Let's get we started. Have some really fun ones today. Look at this toilet bowl. It's like a foaming little toilet bowl candy. I'm not even sure what that is. We have to try it out. Some Mickey Jelly Belly. We even have birthday cake flavored airheads. I think they're sprinkled inside. What else? Ooh, look at this little one. It looks like a little Chinese food container. It's got Hello Kitty candies in there. We have a Flash Pop or a Blinky Pop, not sure. <laughs> Some Crayola candy, mouth dippers. Ooh, even Disney Princess. Shopkins, let's get started. What I've been waiting to open the most is this little foaming toy set. It's got little eyes on there. It looks so, so cute. Let's open this up. Ooh, we even have to put it together. See what we're gonna do with this. Let's open, see what we have in here. Ooh, we got a blue toilet. <laughs> I was hoping for a pink one. Oh well. Here, ooh, it's got an I Love New York. That's kind of funny. Toilet Route 66 and a little hamburger. American flag on there. So funny, all those things. And I guess this is a candy. Ooh, what is all this? We get different flavors. I actually cannot read these. <laughs> But I'm probably guessing this is either watermelon or green apple. Probably blue raspberry and maybe strawberry. Ooh, it shows it there. A little strawberry. Not sure what that one is. And ooh, that looks more like pineapple. We also get this little stick. Step one, we gotta put the potty together <laughs> to eat our candy out of it, I guess. Good. Ooh, it's got too many pieces. I wish it was already put together. So this looks like the back. Here is the base. I think we get this piece next, kind of like an insert. Pop that in there. And then we have a little toilet cover. How cute. <laughs> this even looks like a dolly toilet. It's perfect size for a Barbie or something like that. There we go. Here is the back. Just pop that right in there. And the cover. Ooh, that was super simple. Time to decorate. My favorite part. So, put the little eyes. Looks so precious. <laughs> Cute little toilet bowl ever. So the next step, I guess we can use three different candies one at a time. How about we go with the strawberry, my feet? So I think we just take the top off here. Open this up. Pour it right in there. Ooh, it just kind of looks like this little white powder. Looks like pucker powder, and it's all the way at the bottom. Look at it here. Eep, it's right there. It's funny because I actually thought this was a stick, but it's not. It is a straw too. I guess drink the candy when it starts foaming out of here, like a little soda. This is gonna be so cool. So all we have to do is just get the cap here and add two scoops of water right into the back. There's one. Two. See what's gonna happen. Cannot wait. And something is definitely happening. Look at that. There's starting to be some bubbles coming from there. Ooh, this is so funny. It is starting to foam. It looks like it's backing up. Here it comes. We have an overflow here. It's rising all the way to the top. It's bubbling. Kind of looks like when you put cleaner in the toilet. Look at that. So, so funny. So, I think I'm just gonna stick the straw in and take a little sip. Ugh, <laughs> I do not like that. It's super, super sweet. Kind of tastes a little bit like soda, but soda with 1,000 bags of sugar added to it. But this is the coolest little candy. At first I thought it would just be like powdered sugar. I had no clue it was gonna foam like that. Really, really funny. And if you just spin it around, it foams up even more. 
When you close the lid, look how funny that looks. That looks like a bathroom that's just overflowing. So cool. It even looks like soap suds. So I love the thought of it and this cute little toilet, but I did not like the taste of the candy. Way, way, way too sweet. And if you want to try more, there's also two other kinds, but we have tons of other things to get to. How about some Crayola? <laughs> I love my Crayola crayons and markers, and I didn't know they need candy. It is a color your mouth dipper. Ooh, this looks like fun dip, but I think it actually colors your tongue all different colors. Each powder turns your tongue a different color. Red is cherry, orange, artificial orange, yellow, lemon, green is apple, blue is raspberry, and purple is grape. Let's try them. Ooh, we get tons of them. Oh, these are so cute. They actually kind of remind me of crayons. <laughs> like the cram packs, they look just like it. So we get a little stick. Ooh, and it's vanilla flavor dipper stick. The cutest thing about this is it is in the shape of a crayon. Here's the orange powder, a little lemon, apple. This one is raspberry and cherry. So we get all of those different flavors and more. Let's keep some of these. Let's start with this orange one. Oh, it's so cute. It kind of looks like a Shopkin. <laughs> one of the Shopkin's fruits. So we just take our little vanilla crayon dipper stick. Oh, so, so funny. Just like the shape of a crayon. And we just put this piece. There is the pucker powder. Take a look. Mmm, that does taste like vanilla. Taste in there. Here's your orange sweetness. Mmm. Ooh, that's really, really good. Super tangy. Tastes I just looked like in the mirror and my tongue is completely orange. I guess the difference between this and Fun Dip, this has some type of dye in there. Makes your tongue look like a rainbow. Let's try another flavor. Maybe the blue one. Ooh, how about the grape? Yummy. Little vanilla stick. Give it a little lick. And dip it in. Dip it in. Ooh, it's purple. Ooh, I got a lot this time. Let me taste. Ooh, I like this one more. It tastes a little better than the orange one. Just a little sweeter, but they're both really good. Let me look at my tongue real quick. And it's purple. So, so cool. I love these. Mm, I have so much sugar in my mouth right now. After testing out all six of these flavors, look how colorful they are. Just as pretty as the real Crayola. My favorite one was the blue raspberry. It tasted so sweet, just like a snow cone. And it turned my tongue the prettiest color. It looks exactly like this. up on the candy testing table how about some airheads I don't think I've ever reviewed airheads before and these are really cool because they are birthday cake flavored <laughs> I am dying to know how that's gonna taste if it's gonna be like vanilla here we go Ooh, there's different flavors mystery orange cherry I think this pack is all birthday let's check it out a medium roll. I see all different colors here. What is this? I was wrong. I thought we only had birthday cake flavor, but we get all different kinds, which is good. We can test them out. Birthday cake. This is the cutest package, though. It's got a little cake with sprinkles. Love it. We get the mystery white one, watermelon, orange, cherry, and blue raspberry. Tons of different options here. Let's try this one first. I definitely have tried all of these flavors before, but never this one. Oh, look how cool. It does have little sprinkles. Looks like the Funfetti Cupcake. Look at all of those colors in there. That's how I thought it was gonna look. Mm, you guys, this is the best airhead I've ever had in my life. It doesn't taste like an airhead. It doesn't taste like taffy. It tastes like a cookie. It is so sweet. It tastes like vanilla. It tastes really like Funfetti cake batter. Mmm. So good. 
so creamy. It even tastes like vanilla frosting. Super sweet, love this one. Let's open up these other ones here. What do we have? Mystery flavor, ooh, this one is white too, but this one is more like a vanilla white. This is more like a clear. Let's give it a little taste and see what the mystery is gonna be. Mmm, watermelon, definitely watermelon. Oh, we have another one of those here. That's a good flavor too. Orange, that's a classic one. <laughs> I've been eating these for years. Ooh, that's a bright one. Mmm. Tastes like a tangerine or a clementine. There's a watermelon. This is gonna be bright green. I love the colors on these. Airheads are one of my favorite candies of all, all times. They are so good, so easy to chew. Mmm, love that one. Cherry, another classic favorite of mine. Getting all the colors of the rainbow here. We have the red. So, so good. I think after the birthday cake, this one is my fave. And blue raspberry. Such a bright one. Mm, I have a fruit punch going in my mouth right now. Mm. But definitely the winner is birthday cake. And it's the cutest too. It's got sprinkles. Another fun thing you could do, if you like all the flavors, since these are kind of squishy, you could roll it up into one big ball this is what I used to do. Roll it into a big ball, just like that, and take a bite. Oh, delicious! Next up, how about a little princess? Disney princess. If you guys watch my shows, you would know I'm obsessed with the princesses. I love the makeup sets and everything. I love going to Disney. And these are super cute. They're little fans. Cinderella and Ariel, and I love how in the center of the fan there's like a little symbol, the pumpkin carriage. Over here we have little flounder. They are the cutest, and they have little candies at the bottom. They probably taste like little sweet tarts. Let's try them. For the Cinderella one, Ooh, and this really does give you a good breeze. Summer's coming, it's starting to get hot. Cute little accessory to bring with you to Disney World. Let's see, ooh, you just twist it. You get these cute little brightly colored ones. Mm. Tastes just like sweet tarts and I love how shiny they are. <laughs> they have a really good candy coating. Yummy. And if you don't finish them, all you have to do is just put them right back in that little tube. Oops. Twist it back on. And you have a fan and a snack. Thermos Ariel. Yep, you get yellow, pink, orange, and white. Really yummy. From Princess to Hello Kitty, all of the characters I love. Look at this. I just saw this and I was so excited about it. I don't know if there's like little fortune cookie candies. I don't know. It looks like a Chinese takeout box. Like there's going to be rice or something in here. Ooh, she looks so, so cute. It's like a little tin box. Hmm, I actually have no clue what's in here. It says Lucky Stars Candy. We will find out. See? Ooh, and <laughs> what do you know? They really are. Oh, there's two little stars. I thought there'd be little fortune cookies or something. These are cute. Look how bright they are. And more than these candies, I am just in love with this little box. So, I'm sure these are going to be like little sweet tarts or something like that, just like the other ones. Okay. Those are the brightest. They look good for the 4th of July. <laughs> these are good to like sprinkle on little cupcakes or something. Mmm. Actually, they taste a little better than sweet tarts. They taste a little bit like bubblegum flavor. Really, really good. Super shiny. They don't even look like candies. They look like little plastic beads. <laughs> They're so, so pretty. 
And if you don't finish them, all at the same time. Ooh, here's another cool one. I would call this a candy toy just because it's kind of like a little toy and a candy mixed together it's called a bling pop. Ooh, sparkling strawberry. I think you just pull the bottom up here. Ooh, it does blink. <laughs> Look at that. This thing is bright. Look how bright this is. Looks like a stoplight. So cool if you're at a carnival at night or something like that, everyone would see you. <laughs> so funny it's got like a red color inside and it even has a little lid so when you're done with the lolly you could cover it up let's give it a taste and when you want to turn it off all you have to do is just twist at the bottom and pull it out Oops, like that. and that turns it on let's pop the top off ooh and this is a big one Ooh, that's really good. It's not too sweet. It's a little bit sour. It tastes just like a Jolly Rancher. Such a cute shape too. You get a good grip on it. And it's gonna light up in your mouth just like a little flashlight. every single candy bonanza I do. I think this is like the sixth or seventh one I'm doing. I love candy. I'm just going to keep doing them. I always do Jelly Belly and this is the first time I think I'm having Mickey Mouse one. So cute. It's got different flavors. Ooh, really good ones. Coconut, lemon, red apple, sour cherry. Ooh, I like that one. Sour lemon, berry cherry, wild blackberry. And the thing I love most about these is they are all in Mickey Mouse colors. We got the yellow, and the reds, and the black ones. Let's open these. Whoa! Ooh, look at all these jelly beans. Here we go. So I'm guessing the white is coconut, and coconut is one of the best flavors ever. Mmm. Tastes like coconut milk. So creamy. Love that flavor. There's three different red ones. One looks a little brighter. One is kind of dark and one is kind of like see-through. It's supposed to be red apple, very cherry, and sour cherry. Let's see if this one is. Mmm. Whoa. <laughs> Feels like I bit into an apple. That was so, so good. This one. Woo! Sour cherry. Oh, I like that one too. That is really good. I love Jelly Bellies because they don't taste like the regular plain sugary jelly beans. They have such amazing flavors. I could eat them all day. And I'm sure this one is the Wild Blackberry. Uh, not so crazy about that one. And lemon. I'm also not the hugest fan of lemon. Ah, tastes like lemonade. My favorite is the coconut. And the Macintosh apple. Oh, not a Mac. <laughs> it tastes like a Macintosh apple. Coconut and red apple. Those are really good ones. Icy time. I don't know about you guys, but I love these icy drinks. Every time I go to Walmart or Kmart, I get them. They're so, so yummy. I actually like the red one. There is watermelon and blue raspberry. But these are the dip and lick ones, popping candy. They're kind of like pop rocks with a little lollipop. And I guess they're supposed to taste like those icy drinks. Let's test them. Let's start with the blue. And I love how they have the picture of the cup on there. Really decorates the cup. Ooh, here's our lolly. Blue one. And it looks like there's like these little greenish color pop rocks. Kind of a green blue. Mmm, whoa. So I like this little lolly. This tastes good too. And I'll stick it right in the bag. Mmm, it's covered. Ah! Exploding. Yummy. And the blue raspberry was delish, but I'm thinking the watermelon may taste a little bit better. <laughs> Maybe a little sweeter. And you think it's going to have a green pop? Yeah. Mm, and the lollipop is even watermelon flavor. 
Oh yeah, this one tastes better already. So much better. Okay. Let's see what color those little rocks are in there. Ooh, they're green. They're really bright ones. Ooh, these ones are crackalackin. <laughs> they are really popping in my mouth. I don't know if you can hear that, even more than the blue ones. Mmm, could eat this all day. After testing these icy dippin' licks out, I have to say that they were delish. But I don't know if they tasted exactly like that icy drink. More like Pop Rocks and Lollipop. Napkins fruity gummies, mmm, blue raspberry, strawberry, and green apple. I've had these before, but I always get so many requests to do the Shopkins gummy candies, so here they are. Let's open them up, get a look at the colors and the flavors. Love Shopkins, and Shopkins candy is even better. Ooh, so we get a little pack of, ooh, look at those little Pop Rocks. They're stuck all over my hands. I am so happy we only have a couple candies left because I am so, so sugared out. <laughs> I've had enough for the day. So we have red, green, and blue. Here's the blue ones, and they're in the shape of a little cupcake. I always forget this one's name. Of course, this is Strawberry Kiss, and this is Apple Blossom, but I never, I always get the cupcakes mixed up with Shopkins. I don't know why. And I have all of them, I just can never remember. Here's the blue. Oh, it's so cute. It is in that little cupcake shape. Mmm, tastes just like blue raspberry, really good. These taste a little bit like fruit snacks, maybe a little chewier and sweeter. So they're definitely candies. Oh, little apple blossom. Mmm, that one's really good. That tastes like green apple Jolly Rancher. <laughs> I always say Jolly Ranchers because the green apple Jolly Ranchers are probably one of the sweetest flavors ever. And the strawberry kiss. Oh, here's all three of our little squishy candies. They kind of squish like little mashems. I love all of them. I can't really pick a favorite. They're super sweet and chewy. Woo! And I, <laughs> I am so, so, so sugared out now. I cannot take any more. So here's the final one of the day. And they look super sweet. Trolley Strawberry Puffs. What are these? They look like little marshmallows and they have pink on them. They look so, so yummy. Let's see how they're going to taste. Let's some Bobby go puppies. They just look like little, ooh, they smell so good. They smell good from here. Kind of creamy and fruity. Super pretty, too. They look like little, <laughs> I don't know. They look too pretty to eat. Mmm, these are delicious. These are so, so good. Ooh. They taste like a mix between a really like vanilla marshmallow, kind of like cupcake batter, really, really creamy and milky, and then a super sweet strawberry, kind of like strawberries and cream. I had no clue they would taste this good. Mmm. The best. And look how they twinkle with all that sparkly sugar on there. These are delish. They don't just taste like regular sweet gummy candies. They're a little milky and creamy. Maybe even a little like strawberry ice cream. There it is everybody, the finale of our candy bonanza. I put everything here on the table. Each one was so different and super yummy. And we're gonna have so many more fun and candy toys coming up on the show. This is Bubble Pop Kids. You can click this big red subscribe button here and subscribe to our channel. Have a great day.